This video is brought to you by cdkeyoffice.com, the best place for buying games, gift cards and software keys on a discount. Simply make an account, use the code FOXY for 20% off and enjoy your purchase. Follow the link in the description for more info. Hello everybody and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be talking about how to play any game that you want using your generic USB controller. If you have a generic USB controller, which is a cheap five bucks controller basically, and you tried plugging it into your computer and actually playing a game, you might have noticed that that game is not going to be working, even though the controller has power and it's connected. The problem with this is games on PC basically recognize the Xbox 360 controller and the Xbox One controller and the, and the generic USB controller it does not really fit into that category. So to fix that you're going to need to use a Xbox 360 controller emulator which is this one right here. It's, it's called X360CE. I love it, I use it with most games. I don't use it with FIFA because FIFA has another solution. The Xbox 360 controller emulator is actually, the, uh, this one is actually an edited version so I'm going to be uploading it myself and actually uh, giving you the download link. Do not download it off the official website because that one didn't work for me. But yeah, anyways, all you need to do is plug in your controller, then start mashing your buttons. See if they work. As you can see, for me everything works perfectly. Let's say your buttons are swapped or you click your buttons and it doesn't show, it doesn't highlight. All you need to do is basically go ahead and press the button you want and then press it on your controller and as you can see it's now bound to it. This is, this is literally how simple it is to configure. Now all you need to do is don't close the program, just minimize it and launch whatever game you want and you'll be able to use your controller without any problems. It is crazy simple how easy it is to fix this problem. A lot of people have this problem so I decided to make this video to help you out. Anyways guys this will wrap it up for today's quick tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys learned something new. If you did then be sure to leave a like rating on today's video so you can help this video reach as many people as possible and possibly help them out. And with that being said I will see you guys in the next video.